Okay guys, remember to follow me on Odyssey, BitChute and the rest of it that's linked down below. Odyssey will actually have a little exclusive today, so be ready for that. Now, obviously, we've all been wondering where the legal minds are when it comes to the clown show we are living through right now. People's freedoms have been trampled on, their human rights literally shat on from a great height by snivelling shit weasels like Boris Johnson, Matt Hancock and the rest of them. Now, as it stands, and most of you already know, we have a real possibility of medical apartheid being used to usher in a social credit system and security state. The mandating of medical treatments on medical staff is obviously concerning for the slippery slope it opens up for everyone in general. This is something I've said many times before. Now obviously the legality of much of what has gone on in the past year or so is questionable to me but I ain't a legal mind as I've said about a hundred times before now. This is why I've recently been speaking with a few legal firms about the various amounts of bullshit that's being belt fed to us by the government and of course the media. This involves things like the restrictions on businesses, people's lives and liberty along with the legal routes that we can take against this. So far, I've spoke to three firms in varying degrees of detail with the aim of speaking to at least five different ones, preferably more so we're not just basing anything off what one lawyer has said, but multiple so they can't chat any shit. In fact, I would prefer something like ten firms in total and including all of them being able to speak on the record. Obviously, my main hope is to get some or all of them on the channel to answer some questions from me and from you. This way we can actually get the answers to legal questions that we might have. Obviously, I will keep you updated with it either way it goes because outside of the odd legal challenge, the legal profession has been silent for the last 506 days of two weeks to flatten the curve. I want to know why and I also want to know what people can do about it, not only for myself but for you guys out there and for the people who just don't know.